What's up, guys? Hey, it's James Hurst with The Marketing Show. I've got Charlie here from, where are you from? Hey, I'm from Katy, Texas, and uh, I'm setting up some workflows for my cleaning business. Awesome, awesome. Okay, what's going on here? Right, so I'm setting up uh, after cleaning follow-up sequence, and um, I'm getting stuck whenever I'm building right here the intent for the oh. positive or negative replies. Okay, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm, when I'm replying, when I'm testing the workflow and I'm replying negatively, it's still sending this text yeah. message requesting. Okay. Yeah. So what does it say? It says, would you mind moving this? It goes a long way, helping other people find. Um, would you mind moving this to review? Okay. And if they reply negatively, they should be getting something that says along the lines of, oh, no, I'm sorry to hear that. Would you mind letting yeah. us know yeah. where we were? Okay. Um, Okay. So, so I think you, you, you want to, um, okay. So, uh, for whatever reason, the positive and negative t intent just isn't that great. I don't know why. And okay. so the one way around it is you can say, uh, d uh, you can check for the reply, right. And you can, and then you can ask, um, was it a no, uh, you know, nope. And yes, sure. That kind of thing. So if you want to go down that route, okay. Um, then the actual so uh let's make a new let me just show you where yeah thanks for zooming in so yeah, yeah, no go, ahead and, go ahead and add a branch here okay uh, let's just look at that okay and then uh yeah let's go to the select there and contact reply uh-huh and instead of uh, it's actually yeah the replied message okay and then yeah uh -huh, is or can or you could do contains Gotcha. Uh, yes, you could do yes, right? Yes, and then make another condition, right? Or you could then and make it a or there. Uh -huh. Okay. Or replied message contains uh, sure, right? Or okay. You know, this is where it kind of gets tough because you just don't know. Hi. You don't know what they're gonna say. So um, I actually have a, I actually have a uh, thing called smarter review requests. And okay. the way I do it is I just say, Hey, how was your experience uh, from one to five? Right. It, okay. And they enter one, two, three, or five. Then my branch says one, two, three, or five on the four and the five. I say, Oh, Hey, great. Would you be willing to leave a review? And then that on, on one, two, and three, I say, oh no, like what happened? And then, and then, uh, can you share your, can you share what, where it went wrong? Gotcha. Okay. That's yeah. awesome. So yeah. the way you have set up with the, what I just, uh, avoid even the positive and the negative branches. Yeah. You, yeah. If you can, if you can, uh, kind of, if you can kind of narrow them down right. to, a, you know, Hey, yes or no, then I can look for yes or no, or how was your experience? One, two, three, or four or five then you're expecting and then maybe you have uh the nun you know the nun branch right on the, the bottom right the no. nun the nun oh, branch right so if you say hey one two three four or five and then you're like well do they type in a number do they type in o n e or t w o right so you can you could capture that but if they if they don't do anything if they if they misspell it or they fat fingered it you know typo then you could say oh sorry i didn't get that you know gotcha. what, what was was that a one two you know one through five you kind of get them to go try again so got it no well that's a lot yeah that that's super helpful because i was going to be beat my head here like oh my yeah. god i'm gonna have to put in so many different yeah, you know, yeah. So, in there yeah you don't want i mean in theory you could have like 50 of these positive responses but yeah like i said you just just uh right try to sense. try to narrow them down yes no one, two, three, four, or five, and then kind of go from there. I like the numbering system. Yeah. yeah. I think that would make it easier for them as well, right? If they're really pissed off, they just send a one and that kind of yeah. lets you get a horrible job. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. If you do get a chance, hit, check out uh my uh it's called Smarter Review Requests. Smarter Review. Perfect. And it's cool because uh it tries multiple times, right? It doesn't just try once, it tries multiple times. And if the if it happened to have a landline, right, then um then it also will try by email as well. So it kind of, it starts with texting, then it goes to email. 
Um, and it tries multiple times. It knows whether or not they click that review link because I gotcha. tied that to a trigger link. So it knows whether it's been clicked or not. All righty. I'm going to check it out for sure, man. Thank yeah. you so much. Cool. Any Anything else? Uh, uh, you know what? I think for right now, that's about, I'm sure I'll run into something else and then I'll, I'll probably shoot you a message if I do and we can do another one of these okay. <laughs> so that we can get it recorded. Uh, but yeah, thank you All so right. much. Jason. If I can do cool. anything, for you, let me know. Yeah, I'll, maybe I'll send you a, I'll send you a donation link if you want, if you want to, you know, buy yes, me a coffee yes. or something. Please, I would I love that. I don't drink coffee, but. All right, man. Thanks so much. <laughs> Take care. Well, thank you so much. All nice right. to meet you. Same. Hope you enjoyed the show. Advice given is for educational purposes only and may not be applicable to your business. You should know that the marketing show receives compensation through its affiliate relationship for the products and services it recommends. Thank you for your support and we hope to see you on the next episode of The Marketing Show.